Happening today, a prominent South Carolina attorney at the center of several state investigations will face a judge. Alex Murdaugh is expected in bond court in connection to unpaid settlement money meant for his late housekeeper's family. Now, the housekeeper died in a fall at the Murdaugh's Hampton County, South Carolina home in 2018. Our chief legal correspondent, Seema Iyer, gives us a preview of what to expect as the lawyer heads to the courtroom as a defendant. Disgraced attorney Alex Murda is back in South Carolina and he'll be facing the Honorable Judge Clifton Newman today, 10 a.m. in Richland County Court. Judge Newman has officially been assigned to handle all the Murda matters, including the death of his wife, his son, his housekeeper, and Stephen Smith, whose 2015 death has recently been reopened and connected to the Murda matters. So what's on today's docket for Alex Murda? He will have a bond hearing facing two felony charges accusing him of orchestrating a wrongful death lawsuit filed by his former housekeeper against none other than himself. The arrest warrants say the housekeeper, Gloria Satterfield, fell and hit her head at the Murdaugh's house in Carlton County back in 2018, where his wife and his son were found shot to death in June. Previously, the fall was reported to have happened in the Murdaugh's Hampton home. Now, the new allegations are that after her death, Murdoch coordinated with Satterfield's two sons to hire a lawyer to sue himself in an effort to get insurance as well as payment for funeral expenses and other monetary compensation. A lawsuit was then filed in September by the sons in this case and settled earlier this month. The lawyer Murdaugh recommended? Well, that would be his former college roommate and close friend. Now, Judge Newman will certainly consider the other pending investigations against Murdaugh, as well as his risk for flight when deciding whether he's going to issue a bond at all, and if he does, how much it will be. We'll have much more from court later today. Until then, I'm Seema Iyer, Fox 46.